can share. The couple will now exchange their vows. Jake, repeat after me. I choose you, Abby. I choose you, Abby. To be my wife and my lifelong friend. To be my wife and my lifelong friend. On this day, I declare. On this day, I declare. The relationship that we share. The relationship that we share. And look to the future to strengthen it. And look to the future to strengthen it. I will be yours in sickness and in health. I will be yours in sickness and in health. In failure and in triumph. In failure and in triumph. In abundance and in scarcity. In abundance and in scarcity. I will celebrate the joys of life with you. I will celebrate the joys of life with you. And comfort you in sorrow. And comfort you in sorrow. Together we will dream and live as one. Together we will dream and live as one. While respecting one another. While respecting one another. We will stumble but restore each other. We will stumble but restore each other. We will love openly, freely, and faithfully. We will love openly, freely, and faithfully. We will always continue to know each other better. We will always continue to know each other better. To know ourselves better. To know ourselves better. And to learn to understand God better. And to learn to understand God better. I promise to cherish, comfort, and encourage you. I promise to cherish, comfort, and encourage you. And stay by your side for as long as I live. And stay by your side for as long as I live. Okay, Abby, repeat after me. All right. I choose you, Jake. I choose you, Jake. To be my husband and my lifelong friend. On this day, I declare, On this day, I declare the, relationship that we share, the relationship that we share and look to the future to strengthen it. I will be yours in sickness and in health, in failure and in triumph, in abundance and in scarcity. I will celebrate the joys of life with you and comfort you in sorrow. Together we will dream and live as one. Together we will dream and live as one. While respecting one another. We will stumble but restore each other. We will love openly, freely, and faithfully. We will love openly, freely, and faithfully. We will always continue to know each other better. We will always continue to know each other better. To know ourselves better. To know ourselves better. And to learn to understand God better. I promise to cherish, comfort, and encourage you. I promise to cherish, comfort, and encourage you. And stay by your side for as long as I live. And stay by your side for as long as I live. Right. If we could have the wings. The ring is the symbol of the commitment which binds these two together. There are two rings because there are two people, each to make a contribution to the life of the other and to their new life together. And now, as a symbol of your love and your desire to be forever united in heart and soul, you, Jake, may place a ring on the finger of your bride. Repeat after me. Abby, I give you this ring. Abby, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness to you. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness to you. And now, by the same symbol, Abby, you may place a ring on the finger of your groom. Repeat after me. Jake, I give you this ring. Jake, I give you this ring. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness to you. As a symbol of my love and faithfulness to you. And now one of Jake's best men has requested to conduct the unity ceremony today. Nolan. <laughs> signifies how Abby and Jake are joined by God in marriage. Each chord holds a special meaning. The chord in the center represents God and his everlasting power. And the two outer chords represent Abby and her life and Jake and his life. In braiding these three strands together, Jake and Abby have demonstrated that their marriage is more than a joining of two lives together. It is a unity with God as well. They have chosen to allow God to be at the center of their marriage, woven into every aspect of it. As Ecclesiastes chapter 4, verse 9 through 12 reads, Two are better than one, because they have a good return for their work. 
If one falls down, his friend can help him up. But pity the man who falls and no one is there to help him up. And if two lie down together, they will keep warm. But how can one keep warm alone? Though one may be overpowered, they can defend themselves. And most importantly, a cord of three strands is not easily broken. I will now ask Abby to bring the cords that hang from the brass ring in Jake's hand. Today, Abby and Jake have been woven together by God as one in marriage. Thank you, Nolan. So, by the power vested in me by the state of Illinois, I declare you to be husband and wife. You may now kiss your bride.